When it comes to top stars in the NFL, the story is almost always the same. They were the star of the high school football team, played well in college, and were drafted highly. While that's generally the stereotype for NFL players, there have also been some incredible underdogs who have broken the mold. So here, it's the 7 best underdog stories in NFL history. Number 7. Darius Williams Williams' path to the NFL was not a smooth one. Despite being a talented multi-sport athlete in high school, Williams was overlooked by all the big-time programs, but most young players not making it to a well-known school marks to enter their desire to play. For Williams, it was simply a roadblock to overcome. He ended up at Marietta College, a Division III football program where he played for the year. However, he ultimately left school to deal with family issues back home. Then, Williams moved on to the University of Alabama at Birmingham. His first attempt to join the team failed, while on the second attempt as a walk-on in 2014, he made the team. University counts the football program, then brought it back. But Williams persevered. Despite his impressive stats from UAB in the 2018 season, he was passed over by NFL teams in the draft. The Baltimore Ravens picked him up as an undrafted free agent, but released him after only four weeks. LA Rams coach Sean McVay saw what everyone else had been blind to see and signed Williams. Number 6. Baker Mayfield Mayfield's story is still a riveting one. Coming out of high school, he was seen as undersized and didn't get many offers. He headed to Texas Tech as a walk-on and played well. But a beef with Cliff Kingsbury led him to not getting the scholarship and leaving the university. Mayfield shockingly landed in Oklahoma and wound up shocking fans as he became a top quarterback in the Heisman winner. Being drafted number one overall for the Cleveland Browns, fans still doubted him. But the quarterback helped end the team's long playoff drought. Now, Mayfield is expected to receive a huge contract this offseason by the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Number 5. Warren Moon Moon had very few college offers despite having a very successful high school career. He ended up playing for two years at West Los Angeles Community College and his other two years at the University of Washington. He still didn't generate enough attention, and many scouts still had the stereotype that quarterbacks could not be black players. Moon went on drafted in the 1978 NFL Draft. He eventually became the first professional quarterback to pass for over 5,000 yards in a single season. He was also a nine-time Pro Bowl selection and an NFL Offensive Player of the Year. Moon was also inducted into the Hall of Fame in 2006. Number 4. Julian Edelman Man, the New England Patriots really know how to find diamonds in the rough. Because Julian Edelman was a mediocre quarterback for Kent State in college. However, Bill Belichick saw potential in him and as a quarterback. Instead, the team drafted him in the seventh and final rounds of receiver. Edelman then became one of the most unlikely success stories in NFL history, winning multiple Super Bowls and seeming to himself as one of the greatest postseason pass catchers in NFL history. Number three, Kurt Warner. Warner stores another lesson in determination and believe enough in yourself to keep fighting for what you know you can achieve. His story starts the way you expect for the NFL great. He went from playing in high school to playing at the University of Northern Iowa. But despite being named the Gateways Conference Offensive Player of the Year his senior year, he was passed up during the 1994 NFL Draft and invited to Green Bay's training camp. After getting cut by the Packers, Warner stopped sales at a grocery store for $5.50 an hour. Warner ended up playing arena football for the Iowa Barnstormers until 1997, when he was signed by the St. Louis Rams. Instead of playing with the Rams, he ended up playing for their European League team, the Amsterdam Admirals. In 1999, Warner finally got his chance. Rams starting quarterback Trent Green suffered an injury in the preseason, and Warner was named the starting quarterback. His long wait and patient dedication were rewarded as he led the Rams to a Super Bowl victory over the Titans. Today, Kurt Warner is immortalized in the Pro Football Hall of Fame, with his story turned into a Hollywood movie, The American Underdog. Number 2. Brock Purdy Purdy was the last player chosen in the 2022 NFL Draft, earning him the nickname Mr. Irrelevant because of how unlikely it would be that he would ever play in the NFL. And he has done a lot more than that. Purdy has to fight all odds that were against him. During his rookie year, he led the 49ers to the playoffs, and nobody thought he was capable of doing so, because he was his third string quarterback. In Purdy's second year, he was phenomenal. He set the 49ers franchise passing record with over 4,200 passing yards, and he also led him to the Super Bowl as well. Purdy has one of the best stories in NFL history, probably since Tom Brady. And speaking of Tom Brady, number one. Tom Brady. Brady had been incredible for so long that it's easy to forget that his success was never guaranteed. Arguably the greatest quarterback to step on the field, he famously wasn't drafted until the sixth round of the 2000 NFL Draft. Brady seemed relegated to the backup position for life, giving Drew Bledsoe success. However, after the former Pro Bowler suffered an injury in 2001, 
Your second year quarterback got the starting role. Brady and the Patriots never looked back. Fast forward, Brady has become the greatest player in NFL history, winning seven Super Bowls, six with New England, and one with Tampa Bay.